Hello Kules, welcome back to Vivo Barca and welcome to the home of everything Barca where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates starting with Usman Dembele as it has been reported that Barcelona want to renew the explosive winger further despite recent extension we are going to be discussing on that as we progress then secondly talking about the Barca veterans as it has been reported that Barcelona are considering the possibility of parting ways with at least two of their captains in the month of January. We are also going to be discussing about that. So guys, as we get right into it, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel. If you haven't, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. From being on the cusp of leaving Barcelona to becoming one of their most important players, Ousmane Dembele has had a roller coaster of a year. Ousmane Dembele was involved in a long running contract standoff with the club last season and even became a free agent for a small period before eventually resigning his contract with Barca in the month of July. FC Barcelona handed Ousmane Dembele a two year short term deal, which also includes a termination clause worth just 50 million euros it means that Dembele will enter the last year of his contract in 2023 which could again spark speculation over his future and as per Mundo Deportivo Barcelona are intent on renewing his contract at the earliest possible due to the short duration of his current deal and the affordable release clause which interested the teams can trigger Furthermore, the club have full confidence of the winger after how he has flourished under the watchful eye of Xavi over the past 10 months or so. It is claimed that the administration is happy with Dembele's attitude both on and off the pitch and have made it clear to the winger that they value him greatly and want him to stay, they want to keep him at the club for a long time. With his current deal running until 2024, Barca want to extend it further at least till 2026. Why no negotiations have taken place as of yet? The former Borussia Dortmund attacker is aware of Barca's intentions of wanting to renew his contract again. Usman Dembele has featured in all of the eight games Barca have played this season so far and has chipped in with two goals and four assists already. Xavi has always maintained that Usman Dembele is a key part of his project and wants him to continue at Spotify Camp Nou. President Juan Laporta has also spoken of his admiration for Usman Dembele, even stating that he has, he's even better than Kylian Mbappe. Usman Dembele has really impressed the Barcelona administration as well as Xavi as well as Barca fans as a whole with his performances this season and it's no surprise that Barcelona are contemplating again to you know, to extend his contract further till 2026, according to Mundo Deportivo. Of course, his contract expired last time out um, in the month of June. And I think he was a free agent for just 10 days and Barca renewed his contract. Of course, after huge tensions last time out, Dembele asking for pay, a pay rise and his agent, Musa Sissoko, were even making matters worse. So it was like Dembele will never stay at Barca. Many people were not even happy for the fact that Usman Dembele was prolonging things, making as if Barca have the money to pay him the kind of salary that he was demanding. But at the end, Laporta, who always does his magic, had to make Dembele to take a payment even lower than what he was receiving last time out. So you can just imagine the scenario. Dembele asking for a pay rise, or maybe a better contract, but Barcelona ended up extending his contract on lower terms than what he was even receiving. That's the smartness of Laporta and his administration, you know, so... But despite of that, Dembele still enjoys his time at Barca. He's still feeling so good and he knows very well that there will be a time when he'll get what he wants. So now Barca are going through a lot of financial difficulties and every player that claims to love the club needs to understand that, you know, so Barcelona are contemplating of extending Dembele's contract further. You know his contract expires in 2024 and it will not be surprising for Barca to extend it if he continues playing the way he's played because he has been a very very key player to our team and having Dembele on the pitch is really really interesting to see you know I for one to be honest I was not a big fan of Usman Dembele but with time especially under Javis management Dembele is a different player Dembele is a Dembele that we signed from Borussia Dortmund because when he came to Barca 
he have never lived up to expectations, but seeing the way things have changed drastically for Usman Dembele is just so amazing to see. And I think, you know, he's having the confidence of the manager. And of course, he feels very, very comfortable in Barcelona right now. He knows the club inside out. And I think Dembele is so confident. That's just a big word. He's confident about his abilities, about the coach, the coaching staff, the president. And I think the fit that Barca have in Dembele, it is not a surprising one. And I think his contract will not be the worst decision in the world if he continues playing the way he has been playing so far this season. Then moving on to the next story of discussion, as per a recent revelation made by Luis Mascaro of Sport, FC Barcelona are pondering the option of parting ways with club captains Gerard Piquet and Jordi Alba during the winter transfer window itself. The team captains especially Piquet and Sergio Busquets have done a lot for the team. However, their recent behavior towards a potential downward renewal has left president, um, club president Joan Laporta disappointed. Mascaro writes that despite activating the financial levers, Barcelona continue to have problems with regards to fair play. As it turns out, the president reached out to Piquet and Busquets for a particular collaboration as they earned the highest from the current squad. While the duo initially agreed, their representative backed out of the last, in the last minute, which is why they were forced to sell Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. As a result, Laporta and club treasurer Ferran Olive also had to sanction the a personal guarantee in order to register Jules Koundé. You know, all this left Laporta very disappointed and what is even more troubling is the fact that the aforementioned footballers along with Jody Alba have mortgaged the club to extend that they will collect a whooping 200 million euros in the next year and a half. As a result, Laporta now wants to get rid of his captains as early as possible. Now, as far as Busquets is concerned, he will likely leave on a free transfer when his contract expires next year. But it is not the same with PK and Alba who have contracts that runs till 2024. Building of these claims, journalist David Benabor Reveta adds that there is unanimity um, among the board members that both Piqué and Alba should not continue as Barcelona players beyond the current season. The club considered the veteran defender circle is over and our efforts will be made to offload them as early as the winter window. The management understands it will be difficult operation to conduct but Piquet has already attracted interest from Atletico Madrid. Both Piquet and Alba have hardly played this season and are no longer considered regular starters in the team. Given their current standing within the squad and the massive wages they pocket, it would make sense for Barcelona to part ways with them. So guys, to that we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.